90 Day Fiance's Debbie Aguero is one of the franchise's most entertaining stars. Here are eight times the polite Southern Belle was a major savage. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching for more details. Debbie Aguero is one of the 90 Day Fiancé franchise's most entertaining stars, and she is often an absolute savage. The franchise chronicles unions between Americans and the foreigners they love, and features multiple series, including the original 90 Day Fiancé, as well as 90 Day Fiancé, Happily Ever After, 90 Day Diaries, and others. There is a lot of crossover between the different 90 Day Fiancé series, with cast members often appearing in multiple spin-offs in the franchise. Debbie made her television debut during 90 Day Fiancé, the other way season four, when she moved to Morocco to be with 24-year-old Osama Berber, despite the 43-year age gap. Unsurprisingly, the relationship didn't work out. Osama wanted to move to the United States and Debbie realized that her disapproving son, Julian B. Lin, was right all along. After coming to terms with the fact that Osama had just been using her for a green card, Debbie returned to Sugar Hill, Georgia. Finding herself single again, Debbie appeared on 90 Days, the single life during which she dated Ruben, the Cuban Sanchez. Though Debbie presents herself as a polite, refined Southern lady, there are eight examples of her being rather unrefined. Though Usama was 24 years old by the time Debbie moved to Morocco, they'd started the relationship four years earlier, when Usama was only 20. Like many 90-day franchise couples, Debbie and Osama met online. Osama messaged her out of the blue to compliment her on her art. The two struck up a correspondence, and Osama would send her art and poetry. They shared similar interests, and Debbie said that she felt as if she had finally met someone who understood her. She decided to meet Osama in person after six months of online correspondence. Debbie took several swipes at Ruben's unique fashion sense, which is ironic because of Debbie's wild style choices. After meeting Ruben online, Debbie traveled to Florida to meet him. Her son, Julian, was in tow. Debbie and Ruben hit it off immediately but she said that she felt his style was a bit overkill. She even complained that Reuben was wearing every color God created. The 90 Day franchise star has said that she is more attracted to men who dress conservatively. They are basically the exact opposite of Reuben the Cuban, who likes to be creative with his look. However, that wasn't the last time Debbie wrecked Reuben for his style. During the 90 Day, the Single Life Season 4 reunion special, Debbie sat down with Reuben to talk about the relationship. After seeing what he was wearing to the reunion, she said his outfit was a little over the top for her tastes. She started to pick apart his ensemble. Though she didn't love his pink pants, she thought they could work with a black shirt rather than the colorful shirt and jacket he was wearing. Debbie did, however, love Reuben's socks which had Debbie's face all over them. He revealed that he was also wearing underwear with Debbie's face on them. During the 90 Day Fianza, the other way season for Tell All Special, Chris Foster and Jamie Noguera were at each other's throats. Chris claimed that Jamie cheated on her three times, while Jamie was angry that Chris had disappeared at one point. In response to the disappearance accusation, Shakina Chris Garner insisted looks that so she was different only gone one of her five old days. Unseen well, pictures. Jamie claimed she had disappeared Ninety Day Fiancé fans months. are stunned to see well, how much women are changed amid over the ashes years. of their relationship. Social media Debbie users are shocked to see how different Shakina Garner is. It's very easy for a predator to take advantage of Chris. The other way looks Ninety in one Day of her fianza. old pictures posted the other way by a social media user. Tell all host Sean Robinson. She can now recently debuted in the Ninety Day Fiancé franchise with her turkey based boyfriend. She asked Debbie if she was really calling Jamie a predator. Sarper and Chikina may be two of the yes, good-looking cast members of the day. season, 
but their relationship is full of red Debbie flags. Was dating online in 90 days, she fiance. lied about her age. The other way, season five, finding it harder Sarger to attract online matches in by her true age range. Way. She reduced her age by ten not years weigh over while 100 using dating apps. 28 pounds. She or claimed have that her muscular true age body made it difficult to just date like the men she was Shaken interested in. Obsessed with her physical she considered appearance. lying about her age. Her throwback pictures show that lie. she has undergone various Debbie cosmetic online. treatments and went out on a date with him look. during 90 days. A redditor, the single loud life season four. Carpenter, 8,000. she initially told Russ that she was 57 years posted old when instead of 67 photos with the title, she came clean to him during off their first the fillers and botched While surgeries. Russ claimed that he wasn't too Since bothered Jake by Debbie's now lie. Has bigger lifts, he did a see it as a red flag. And enhanced cheekbones. Frankly, it was Russ difficult more for other redditors to recognize her in the throwback relationship. photo. Was with a Moroccan Reddit man user who said, was "My brain can't junior. comprehend that that's the same person." Debbie on a second date. Like I don't see it. During the 90-day, another redditor the single commented, season, "There's no resemblance at all." Special. Franchise star Chantal Everett changed into a sweatsuit briefly. To give her the fellow other castmates a twerking lesson, Sarper demanded Shakina to only bear his child Rodriguez and insulted her to take when part she in the twerk to shop. Obey his request. But once Veronica sat down, he disrespected Miss her Debbie by saying it would resist only take him two days stop. to forget her. Chantel talked up with him and returned to the United up States and drop it down like the best of toxicity in their relationship. After the lesson, Sarper a delighted and Debbie proudly proclaimed, perfect couple. "I can say I twerked the with Chantel." During the latest 90-day fiancé, though Debbie performed the act admirably. She ultimately the wasn't new franchise pair saying, declared their still I just can rather do the other. bougie Detroit Over style. the years, Shakina has offered her 90 day franchise career necklace, Miss Debbie a brow lift, one to hold an back upper her plasty, and Botox, her appearance on and 90 injections. Day. To enhance the single her life season features, four was which no is why exception. she looks unrecognizable Debbie in was her in old full photo. photos during the tell all Social media users aren't wrong to discuss went after how much the day new answer. reality star has changed season, in the past star few years. Sarper Govan repeatedly. Since Shikana was previously was featured out on to another advise dating day. reality TV show, the single life star Tyra Mollet on how to lose his virginity being in front Miss of the Debbie camera. rushed in to chastise she probably wants to keep being a womanizer with her appearance later during the 90 day. Version. The and show life season for tell -all. on national TV. Shown asked the cast who else from the franchise they be interested in dating. Low self -esteem. After everyone gave it their answers, it doesn't help that Sarver also wants her to be under one of the women had twenty pounds Sarver. and dressed to which Debbie quickly quipped. Besides, you'd have to dress up in a hazmat suit to go on a date with Sarver. That's procedures to look her how I feel as an aesthetician. Debbie's statement she was in probably to the fact she needs that to Sarper undergo different surgeries with to come off as an women. expert aesthetician during the 90 and day. More clients to her clinic life in Los Angeles tell all. Hopefully, young the new 90 day fiance, fiance season the other way star was brought out to discuss his divorce from single Vita. life cast member Natalie Mordovseva. During his appearance, he had 90 day franchise star Debbie Johnson serve Natalie the divorce papers. Unsurprisingly, everyone seated on the stage was horrified by that act. Miss Debbie immediately went after Mike about serving Natalie's divorce papers on television. Debbie Johnson then came to Mike's defense, telling Miss Debbie to leave him alone. Miss Debbie turned her ire on Johnson, snapping, and you're a Judah's man. The act was seen as a betrayal because Debbie Johnson and Natalie were allegedly close. Debbie Johnson made her television debut on 90 Day Fiance Season 6, when her son Colt Johnson married Brazilian Larissa Santos. Debbie later got her own storyline in 90 Day, The Single Life Season 3. The Battle of the Debbies escalated after Part 5 of the Tell All had already concluded. As the cast got ready to leave the studio for good, the Debbies once again descended on each other. Miss Debbie brought up the painful past and told Johnson that she finally understood why Colt didn't want his mother around. Johnson angrily demanded that Miss Debbie stop talking about her family, to which Miss Debbie snapped, Then get my name out of your mouth, woman.